Hey boss babe, hey boss babe. Happy Friday to you. Happy Friday, happy Friday. I don't know where you're watching me. I just want to wish you a happy Friday. And on my side, it's already evening. I know you're starting your Friday. Happy Friday and good day as well. Anyway, uh, today's talking is we're going to learn. We, today's talking is going to be about how to set boundaries, baby girl boss babe it's a time for us to set boundaries if we never set boundary boundary in the past years or in 2023 we never set boundary 2023 is almost finished it's two weeks to go we're going to 2024 what is our goal what is our plan it's we 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 have to stop letting people manipulating us draining us draining our body treating us as a trash no or us treating another, another people like that we have to set boundary. Learn how to set boundary at your work, with family, with friend, with uh, in your business. Learn how to set boundary. If you never set boundary in 2023, that is the time for you to complement boundary in 2024. Trying to set boundary in your daily life and be consistent. When you're setting that word with people, when you're setting boundary in your life, be consistent of what? Because sometimes when we set boundary, we are not consistent. We are not consistent. What is the meaning of setting boundary? The meaning of bound the meaning of the meaning of boundary is learning how and when to say yes or no, or learning to honor yourself, to respect yourself, and to treat yourself right. And also, boundary it can be you can be consistent on what the word of you saying if you don't want people to treat you trash you need to start respecting yourself you need to try to understand yourself because when and boundary is a, is a, is where you the, you set time and places and words and also you need to be honest by yourself and boundary you need to be boundary is learning how to be honest by yourself when you set boundary you need to learn to be honest by yourself and you need to learn how to talk with people you need to learn with your talking you need to set boundary in your daily life at work you need to set boundary in your business in your marriage in your with kids with whatever you do in your daily life try to set boundary because when you set boundary you think if, if you you think so be easy in your life because when we don't have boundary we try to have problem all the time because we don't have boundary because even you when you set boundary even in friendship your friendship will last long when you don't have boundary in friendship that is where problem comes because you you guys will do things no boundary because when is the boundary and the friendship your friend will know her boundary and you know your boundary. When is boundary in a marriage? Your husband will know the boundary and you know the boundary. When is boundary in, 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 with the family or with the kids? The kids will know their place and you know your place. You, you know where to stand and you know your place. And that is the time. Set that boundary. Trying to scratch down on 2024. 2024, I was like this. Let me be like this. Be that woman. Be that woman, be that elegant woman, be that feminist, be that boss babe. Set the boundary. Learn how to talk to people as well. When you set boundary, you know how to talk to people. You know your boundary when you're talking. Be nice on your voice, on your tone. Boundary is not, be nice with people. It doesn't mean when you set boundary, you have to be arrogant. You have to be wherever. You need to be nice with people. You need to learn how to communicate with people. You need to learn as well how to understand people. People to understand you, you need to learn how to understand them. And you need to learn how to understand you first. Respect you first. Be authentic with you first. It's not about people, it's about you. Be authentic. If you want everything to be smooth in your life, set boundary. The boundary is the key. Of successful on that thing even in a business we have to set boundary that's what I wanted to talk to you guys learn we need to learn how to set boundary if we didn't set boundary in 2023 
in 2024 coming we need to learn how to set boundary it's not only 2024 in our daily life we need to learn how to set boundary for us to be okay for us to be respected for us to be treated with respect we don't have to let someone to treat us as a trash or to drain us our emotion our body no if what let me give you the example of boundary example you were planning uh to stay home your friend called you Oh, let's go somewhere because you don't have boundary. You say you because you want to please, because you want to please that your friend because you want to help that friend need you go, but you forgot you have something to do at home. You forgot you have something to do for yourself because you don't have boundary. Because when you have boundary, your friend call you say, "Sorry, darling, I have planned to do this at home. Probably we can do it another day in a nice way." Even at work, when they call you and you have, example, they call you for a shift, you don't want to go for the shift or you already planned something because before you know, you didn't know how to set, but when they call you, just pick up your bag, you go, no, trying to talk, trying to communicate, trying to communicate, trying to set, but no, this is my time. I need that time for me. I need that time for me and my family. I need that time. They call you, you say, please, I'm okay to do the shift, but can I do it tomorrow? Because today I have planned to do this with my wife. Because you have boundary and you need to be consistent on what you say and your word. Be consistent. That is only the example I'm giving to you. I hope you hear me. Let's set boundary, boss, babe. Let's set boundary, baby girl. Let's set boundary our daily life if we want people to respect us. I hope so. You hear me. Thank you.